So back to school. Okay, so I'm just gonna create a back to school discount, and um, this is gonna be like five dollars off. Five dollars. There we go. Specific product. Um, so yeah, just this product right here. It looks like the one I just made. I'm gonna click that. Um, and then okay, yeah. So there is some minimum requirements: customer eligibility, usage limits, limit to one per customer, and then it's gonna start today. There we go. So I just created a discount back to school. They got the uh, the free shipping, buy one get Y. Yeah, so those are the kind of discounts they have. And if I click right here, I'll actually see how the store looks like. So this is a store. Um, it says announce something here. It's really, uh, really bare bones. It's just a template at this point. I'm going to go ahead and click on catalog. Yeah, I think, yeah, catalog. And then, woo, I don't even know where my product is at. It says it was live, so let's go back here and find out exactly where it's at. Products, it's this vendor. Um, if I click on it, it will go to the product page where it's got product type collection premium um and all the information about the product here and at the very bottom the search engine listen preview so very very similar to shopify and the product page but i kind of do like the style the whole style of shop base it's it's nice it looks nice i'm gonna click view see if i can find it oh so products and then yeah that's where it's at so this is the product page and i haven't really done anything to the product page and it says 16 d the price i i don't know why it says d but i'm thinking that means dollars it's a little different there um the colors are right here and um yeah the size and then this uh, trust badge is uh, actually came with the store theme. And um, yeah, and this this right here, I didn't write that on, uh, as you could tell, that was um, built in. And then, uh, as you can see, when I scroll down, uh, at the very bottom, there is a sticky buy now button. And I'm sure that looks really great on, on uh, mobile. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually going to check real quick. If I go to developer mode, we're, we're going to take a look at how it looks like on mobile. So this is how it looks like on mobile. Um, yeah, with the sticky thing at the bottom. So it's already, like, it seems like it's already pretty optimized. So after after this goes up at the top, it's already, it's already optimized. And then let me see how the... Uh, checkout page looks like so this is the checkout page um it looks like the shopify checkout page but again um it could be customizable i'm gonna i'm gonna go ahead and fill this out um so on okay Twenty dollars for international shipping. O M G. Hold on. Okay, so there was a problem with the payment. Contact us. All right, so um, I haven't set up the checkout the the checkout yet. But the shipping is ridiculous. Twenty dollars for international shipping. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and add a shipping policy. 